Assalamu alaikum. I am Nazmul Shweth, lecturer in physics under the Department of Physics in Boishal Kavad College. Due to corona pandemic, you will stay at home, and uh, I believe that you are safe and sound in your home. And uh, I also believe that, inshallah, we will meet again very soon. Firstly, I discuss uh, something about corona pandemic situation. Boys, you must be careful about corona pandemic situation because uh, we pass the second phase of uh, corona pandemic situation and uh, it uh, must be a winter session. And uh, we know that uh, in winter season, corona shows his uh, more dangerous face. So you must stay at your home and uh, you must wash your hand and uh, must expand time at 20 seconds uh, don't touch your face uh, that means uh, mouth and uh, nose and eyes without to wash your hands and uh, always time avoid close contact with uh, flu like syndrome persons again today we discuss and uh, the obviously this is the last class of chapter 10 that is phenomena of electricity and magnet. And uh, the learning outcomes of uh, today's class is number one, different between magnetic and non-magnetic substance. Number two, demonstrate the properties of uh, magnets. Number three, demonstrate the process of preparing magnetic from non-magnetic substance. Number four, I explain electric magnets and uh, last one that is five explain earth magnetic field so no more delay we are going to our first uh, topics that is the uh, magnetic and non-magnetic substance firstly we, we are going to start our topics firstly i show you a picture uh, that is uh, nothing but the picture of magnets uh, it is not uh, north pole and it, it is South poles. We know that uh, magnets is a one kind of uh, substance which attack the magnetic substance. And uh, magnets uh, shows the attraction in parallel. It shows the direction of North Pole and South Pole. That's why uh, we say that uh, magnets have two poles. That is North Pole and South Poles. And the North Pole uh, shows the direction of uh, south poles of the earth and uh, north, uh, south pole uh, of the magnet shows the direction of the north pole of the earth so th this is nothing but some description about magnets and uh, magnets uh, uh, is a attraction of sets of mag magnetic uh, materials and uh, we know that uh, the magnetic materials uh, uh, the example is uh, iron, nickel, cobalt, and stainless steel. So magnetic substance uh, is a substance which is attracted by the magnet. And uh, the example of magnetic substance is iron, nickel, cobalt, and stainless steel. And uh, stainless steel is nothing but is a compound or compounds of some other materials that must be contain iron nickel and cobalt also and uh, here uh, i show two uh, magnets and uh, this is bar magnets and this is u shaped magnets every magnets have two poles that means uh, north poles and south poles so u shaped magnets or bar magnets is nothing uh, both magnets have two poles that's north pole and south poles and if you divide uh, of a one bar magnet and make it a hundred types of magnets then every magnet uh, must be contain two poles that north poles and south poles so one bar magnet have two poles north poles and south poles and if you divide one bar magnet and make it two then these two magnets also contain uh, two north poles and two south poles. So when you divide or cut up on magnets, they are automatically produce 
to poles of that magnets. Uh, for shortly uh, memorized of these uh, materials names, uh, I give you an example. I can see nick. So uh, in I, that means iron, can the first word of C is cobalt and C the first word is steel and nick is nickel. So shortly uh, we can memorize the uh, magnetic substance that is iron cobalt steel and nickel so you must be memorized which one is magnetic substance for more information of magnetic substance magnetic substance uh, uses to prepare magnets for future use so if you need a, a magnets and if you are interested to produce or make a magnet, then you must be collect these four types of substance to uh, make a magnet for future purposes. So when you uh, prepare or made a magnet, you must be collect uh, the materials of iron or cobalt or steel or nickel. That's all for magnetic substance. Now I show you that is some kind of non-magnetic substance. So, Firstly, we discuss about magnetic substance. Magnetic substance is nothing but uh, it's attacked by the magnets. That's why we call it magnetic substance. If any kinds of materials uh, is, uh, is not attacked by the magnets, that, that's we call non-magnetic substance. So in pictures, I uh, give you some examples and uh, from the discussion, uh, before the slides, uh, these slides, uh, what is magnet and what is non-magnetic substance, you must be clear about. For more discussion, uh, I take uh, a part that is glass, and we know that magnet not attack the glass, so uh, glass is a non-magnetic substance, and uh, here is a wool, and uh, it uh, never be attacked by magnets, so it also be the non-magnetic substance. Leaf is also it's a non-magnetic substance. Eraser is a non-magnetic substance, and uh, we also know that uh, the tables is a uh, materials of wood. It never be attacked by the magnetic substance or magnets. So that's why we call that it's a magnetic non-magnetic substance. But uh, if we take uh, uh, the screw, it uh, must be attacked. Uh, a magnets that's why it's a magnetic substance so which one is attacked by a magnet is called magnetic substance and which is not attacked by the magnet is called non-magnetic substance and from the examples you must be clear about what is magnet and what is non-magnetic substance now uh, i discuss about uh, the properties of magnets but you must be careful about uh, the animation of the pictures. Uh, here, two materials is attacked each other. But uh, in uh, upper hand pictures, uh, there is a gap between two materials, and uh, it never be come on the surface of that uh, materials. That means uh, it repels each others. So. In the lower part, there is an attraction, and in the upper part, there is a repulsion. So uh, this is the same kind of properties as like the charge properties. Is magnet is a one kind of attraction substance. It also be uh, it's a repulsion substance. When uh, the opposite poles, boys, you must be careful about when the opposite poles of a magnet is uh, come each other, then is uh, attack each other but uh, when the same poles is uh, come each other then it repels uh, each others so uh, it, it is the properties as like the charged uh, particles uh, we know that in uh, electricity uh, the same charges is repels each other and opposite charges is attack each others as the same poses uh, the opposite poles of a magnet is attacked each others and uh, the same poles are repulsed each others. So this is nothing but the 
same uh, properties of charges if you uh, memorize the properties of charges then you can easily describe the properties of magnet also now again i say something about corona pandemic situation you must 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 stay at home because we pass the second phase of the pandemic situation so you must be stay at home uh, avoid uh, touching your face that's why you must uh, wash your hand frequently and must be spend 20 second and uh, avoid co close contact with flu like syndrom persons now i uh, describe, uh, describe uh, that is the uh, demonstrate the process of preparing magnet from non magnetic substance uh, or making a magnet boys uh, you look here uh, this is a, this is a one kind of post and uh, this is nothing but a wire post and uh, this wire is uh, bending uh, in a substance and uh, on the other hands of the wire is come here and this is a battery and the first end of a battery is connected this end and uh, this end is not visible but uh, we see here uh, this uh, this is a light is a uh, uh, flash up is a uh, light uh, when the wire is connecting uh, in the battery or in the wire and the, this end uh, is uh, connected uh, in this uh, poles so uh, this is nothing but say, simple circuits that's why uh, the current comes from these paths under the tables and uh, comes to these lines and uh, this turning path is a bending uh, and it's a copper wire and it comes here and the end is come to join to this end of the battery but when it is connected uh, the pin uh, that, that is a uh, stobler pins uh, is uh, attacked by the rods because uh, this is the phenomena of farad's law farad's prove that when a solenoid uh, what is boys uh, don't be uh, serious about what is solenoid solenoid is nothing but say uh, a bar uh, is a uh, and a wire when the wire is a uh, uh, bending uh, in the bar or the upper surface of the bar then uh, and uh, when we pass current this uh, wire this uh, bar act as a magnets that's why the stabler pins or uh, pile pins is attacked by the bars that's why is the process or, or that is the process to produce magnets uh, in a simple way by using uh, simple uh, some wires and a battery and where a battery is connected these uh, joining wires and uh, we connect it then this bar act as a magnets so this is the simple process to produce magnets uh, and uh, this is the process to preparing magnet from non magnetic substance uh, uh, because uh, when we supply current in the magnets uh, that's why we can process in the magnets and other hands uh, if we, we take a magnetic substance or a magnet and uh, rubbing each others uh, then after some time you uh, see that the non magnetic substance also shows the properties of a magnet so this is the process to make a non magnetic substance to make it uh, magnets or non magnetic substance make it magnets simple uh, rubbing process you also produce the uh, magnetic substance uh, why you produce this if you need uh, any magnetic uh, many of magnetic substance or magnets then uh, you rubbing a magnetic substance with the magnets then after some time the magnetic substance uh, shows the properties of magnets so from this slide i describe two ways to produce magnets so one is uh, supplying electricity to produce magnets and another is rubbing process so i show you two poses to produce magnets 
parallelly. Now uh, I show you the electric magnets. Boys, it is too dangerous and it is a too powerful magnets. Uh, from the animation picture of this slide, you see that uh, when uh, uh, the coiling magnets, uh, this is the coiling magnets and uh, here the power supply is too high. There's a positive negative ends of the power supply. This is the uh, bending coils. So uh, if we take uh, any kinds of uh, uh, substance, then the substance is uh, uh, solid to liquid, it turns its phases uh, with the uh, strong uh, field of magnets. So this is the process of electric magnets. And uh, before the slides, these slides, we also describe the electric magnets and how to produce electric magnets and what is the uh, application of electric magnets. I show you this uh, slides and also show the process of produce electric magnets. So when you uh, supply electricity in a bending coils, this coils shows the properties of magnets. That is nothing but the electric magnets. And uh, lastly, I describe uh, the uh, earth magnetic field. Boys, uh, uh, we know that uh, when a bar magnet is hanging by a thread, the, the, this magnet shows the uh, properties, uh, the direction of the uh, earth north pole and south poles. So uh, our, uh, and the properties of a magnets, we know that the opposite poles is attack each other and same forces repulse us each other. So when a bar magnet is hanging by a thread and uh, the poles of a magnet uh, shows the north poles, that means the opposite poles is attack each other. So a bar magnets in the upper hand animation pictures, this is the north and south. So the bar magnet shows the south poles of the earth and uh, the bar magnet of a south pole shows the north poles of the earth. That's why the south pole and north pole is at each other and uh, oppositely the north pole and south pole is it at, at each other. And uh, what is field? Field is no nothing but the reason where uh, the uh, magnets is attack each other is uh, visible. Uh, we know that when you take two magnets each other after some distance it's attack each other but when you take uh, the distance is far then it, it doesn't show this attack each other uh, so uh, where the reason and uh, the reason where we feel the attack each other this reason is called magnetic field and uh, uh, after uh, creating some distance it never we feel attack each other this uh, this is the field out of the magnetic field. And uh, how to create the magnetic field? We know that uh, this is uh, nothing but the lines of force. It is, it was careful, it's imagination lines. And uh, we think that some of the lines is uh, produced from North Pole and is, uh, uh, end is South Pole from some lines, imaginary lines, but careful, it's an imaginary line that's uh, produced from uh, uh, North Pole and uh, ends is South Pole and uh, where and how many reason is covered by the lines there must be produced the magnetic field. So this is uh, nothing but the magnetic field and uh, this is also the uh, field of uh, the attraction reason. So some uh, knowledge based question in this uh, regards uh, what is the magnet explain what is is a magnetic field and what are the characters of magnetic field? Some compression based question, how do magnet works? Why magnet is important? How can magnet produce? How magnet work? Some uh, MCQ question, how many poles of a magnet? So from the discussion, you must be careful how many poles of a magnet, how many properties of a magnet. You must be known about how many properties of a magnet and what is magnets? Uh, it's uh, discussed also and uh, we more about things about magnets. Uh, and uh, some uh, homeworks. There is a one critical question is for homeworks. Two uh, pictures and uh, question is what is magnet? Uh, number B explain briefly magnetic and non magnetic substance. And number C which process uh, the figure B shows the direction of the earth poles and uh, uh, is there any relation between figure A and B? 
explain. If you have any query, I discuss it in the second session that is in uh, replying dashboards. Lastly, I discuss again uh, the corona pandemic situation. You must be stay at your homes. Uh, don't uh, go outside of your homes about close contact with flu-like symptoms. And uh, lastly, I show you a video clips uh, for more uh, information about
Bye.